What's going on everybody? This is Justin, otherwise known as the Flipping Accountant, and today we've got a quick eBay tutorial for you. If this is your first time to the channel, my name is Justin. I'm a full-time CPA, and in my spare time, I buy and resell stuff on Amazon, eBay, and Facebook Marketplace. I like to make tutorial videos and try to make things easier on you when you're buying or selling stuff online. So today's update video is gonna be about how you can request funds on eBay, and they have this new feature where you can request immediate payment, which is great because normally the payout schedule is either daily or weekly or monthly, and I'll show you how to change that as well. All right, so we're on the main eBay page right here. We're gonna go to my eBay, then we're gonna go down to selling. It is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven from the top, gonna click selling. This is gonna take you to the main eBay page right here. This will have all of our sales and information from our main summary page of the seller's hub. And right here, they've actually got this spring seller update, learn about our latest seller updates and changes for 2020. And then this is how I actually figured out about how you can do this now. I'm gonna open this up and I'm gonna have this on another page, but we'll talk about that here in just a minute. The easiest way to do this to request the payment is go down. We're gonna move over here from the right gonna go overview, orders, listings, marketplace, store, performance, payments. You're looking for payments right here. From payments, you're gonna go down to summary. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seventh from the left. Then you're gonna click summary. It's the first button right here. Payment summary page right here. This is the financial summary. This shows my total funds right here. And this explains, if I click on this little question mark, it'll explain how long does it take to get paid. Once the buyer's order is confirmed, we initiate your payout within two days. It typically takes one to three days for the funds to clear your bank account. And then these are the different fund statuses that we need to know about. There is available. This is the money that's available right now. Processing, after a buyer pays, we process their payment. These funds become available once processing is complete. And then on hold, funds have this status. If a buyer reports an issue, if you are if you are a new seller, we'll let you know if you, if you need to take any action to make these funds available. And then if you want more information on holds, you can click that right here. So we're gonna close this and we're gonna scroll down again. So right here, we've got our available funds. And it says I've got $25.08, which is just amazing. This says my next scheduled payout is Tuesday, May 3rd, because that's just how I have mine set up. I have it set up for monthly payments. You can adjust this. So if you actually want to request money right here, the request payout button is right there. Also shows that I have $58.93 in processing. And then it shows my last payout of $42.30 sent on April 5th to my bank account. So right here, we've got our available funds, processing, and last payout. If I want to request this money right here, I can just click request. This is going to pull up and it's going to say available amount. This is going to tell you how much is there for withdrawal. So it'll say bank account ending in and then typically arrives in one to three days. And then you can actually change this amount. You could change it to like 10 bucks, or if you had a ton of money sitting around, you could change it to whatever. For me, if I wanted to request the entire amount that is available, I can just type it in right there. And then I'll just scroll down right here. And it says settlement times or estimates request after 1500 PDT may be sent the next business day. And then you can click send my money now right here. And then it'll initiate a transfer to send that money to your bank account. Again, it'll take within one to three business days for it to be sent. You can change the amount here and then you click send my money now. And that's it, pretty straightforward. I wanted to share this with you guys because I think this is kind of a cool update that they've got. So this information came from the seller update and this is a little button they had, it said fees and financials. So I wanted to go over this with you guys. So we'll kind of run through this really quick. And it says on this page, what you need to know, on-demand payouts, additional flexibility with new scheduling, payout scheduling options, and introducing spendable funds, which I think is kind of interesting. So more flexibility and control of your money. They've got the on-demand payouts. And this says over the next several weeks, we'll be enabling on-demand payouts for sellers who have weekly, bi-weekly, or monthly payout schedule. You'll be able to request a payout of all or part of your available funds on demand. So that's what we were just looking at. So see, I had $25 available, 2508. So I could request all of that, or I could just request part of that and I could take it all now or I could leave it for later. Over the next several weeks, so if you're watching this video and you're like, Justin, I don't have the request now button, that's because eBay says that it's taking time, they're gonna roll this new feature out to other sellers 
and other eBay users over time. So if you're watching this and you don't have the feature yet, just keep an eye out because it says over the next few weeks it'll be there. They also have additional flexibility with new payout scheduling options. They're just talking about how you can also change it to the monthly, bi-weekly, or weekly payouts. So you can set it to those, like you can set it to the monthly payout or the weekly payout and then just leave it there if you want to but it says that you can always just go back and just request that money, which is nice. So like I have mine set to monthly, but if I wanna request it today, I can do that. So that's really cool. I think eBay is trying to compete with you know, Amazon and these other platforms where you can sell stuff and get your money faster because some eBay or some Amazon sellers can just request their money right away. Monthly payouts of available funds are sent to your bank on the first Tuesday of the calendar month. Bi-weekly are sent to the bank on Tuesdays. Daily payouts are sent to your bank within two days after the payment's confirmed. So all of that's right there. This is the new feature, spendable funds. In the coming months, so this may not be available yet. In the coming months, sellers will be notified that they have the option to use the earnings from their sales to fund their eBay purchases without waiting for a payout to their bank account. Now, I think that's kind of an interesting feature that you'd be able to use this money before it's actually like processed and cleared. Before you can actually send it to yourself and then wait, you'd have this money as spendable and then you could use it right away in your business. So it says right here, when you sell, your earnings become spendable funds as soon as the buyer pays. You can spend it now, save it for later, or use them for selling expenses like labels and fees. It's up to you. I don't know, I think it'll be a neat little addition. Instead of having to wait two days for it to process and then two days to send it back to your account, you could just use it right away, which I think is kind of good. When you're ready to purchase, you can use your spendable funds as a payment method at checkout. That's great. I think eBay is really just trying to get people to use more of their platform instead of using PayPal since they split into different companies. So eBay is saying you can have your money now, you can spend your money now. If you prefer, you may also schedule daily payouts, but if you do so, you will no longer be able to request an on-demand payout because you will already have our fastest payout option. Okay, now that's something I didn't catch before. So if you're actually on the daily payouts, then you can't do the request payouts. So I think the on-demand payouts gives you nice flexibility. It's a nice little addition in case you actually need the money sooner. Or say you sell something really big. Let's say you sell like a camera for 500 bucks and you're like, I don't wanna wait until the end of the month or one of your next scheduled payout is you can just request that money. So before we're finished here, I wanna just show you real quick how you can make these changes if you wanna change from the daily, the weekly, and the monthly and all of that. So we're back here on the payment summary page right here. Again, we've got the total funds, available funds that I can request right here processing and then the last payout right here on the what's new the payouts on demand it just has more information about the payouts on demand it says what funds can i request you can request your funds at any time does include funds that are processing or on hold payments typically arrive to the bank within one to three business days and then what happens if i don't request my funds if you're not on scheduled payments they'll be automatically paid out to your bank account 180 days from the last time we credited funds to your balance. So make sure that you have one of these methods selected so you're not waiting 180 days for that money. And then right next to it, we've got new payout options. You can actually change the payout options from this button right here. If you click payout schedule, it'll take a second to pull up. You've got the on-demand payouts, which we just walked through. And then the scheduling payouts, you can change it to daily, which will disable your on-demand payouts. Daily, weekly on Tuesdays, bi-weekly every other Tuesday, or monthly on the first Tuesday of each month. And then they have a very helpful tip down here. It says a longer payout schedule might give you more time to accrue available funds to cover selling costs. Wow, thanks for letting us know. So if you wanted to make a change, you could click one of these. If, if you want to do weekly or bi-weekly, you could click these and then click save, and then that would change it. Hopefully this kind of gave some explanation into how to use the new payout and then where it's applicable. If you guys have any questions, feel free to drop them in the comments below. If you enjoyed this video or if it helped you in any way, shape or form, do me a favor, smash that thumbs up button for me. Leave me a comment below. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. We'll talk to you later.